Hello, welcome to the alpha rig overview video. For this video, we'll be going over where to find FK IK switching, space switching, follow switching, a special feature that we have for the IK spine controls and the secondary tweak face and hair controls. Um, so yeah, let's get into it. For Alpha, she set up like a pretty standard um, bipedal character rig. So if you've used a bipedal character rig before, you're probably going to be familiar with her setup. Um, for Alpha, if you're looking for any of the FK switching, space switching, or follow switching, for any of the limbs, you know, arms, legs, head, neck, um, you'll want to go to this menu back here select the limb that you want to change and there you'll find the ik fk switching the arm follow spaces auto stretch ik follow um, and the pull vector follow as well and this applies to both arms both legs head neck and on the chest you'll find auto stretch as well you'll also notice that on the on the chest we have a distribute rotation um, feature as well and what that means is, is, is that Alpha only has controls for an IK spine, meaning that she has her main chest control, a main pelvis control, and then a mid control for controlling the curvature of that spine. And if you go to distribute rotation, when the rig automatically comes to the scene, that feature will automatically be set to 0.5. But if I set it to zero, then when I rotate her chest, it acts exactly like a pure IK spine. Meaning when I rotate it, if I want to get that lean that happens when we, you know, when we rotate our chest, I'll have to rotate and then translate and maybe rotate a little bit more. And now she's leaning a little bit to the right. But if I go back to dispute rotation and I turn it up to one, now, her chest acts exactly like a pure FK chest. When I rotate her forward, when I rotate her to the side, that lean is automatically put in there. When the rig comes in, it's automatically set to 0 0.5. So you kind of get a little bit of like the best of both worlds, um, if you like animating like that. Um, but you can set it to whatever you like. I've used both while animating, and um, both work quite well. So. The next thing that I'd like to show you is, is that we have secondary controls um, on Alpha. And to manage the, con the control visibility, you'll want to select the main cog back here. And this one turns off all the controls. And this one turns on the secondary controls. And this one turns on the tweak controls. For the secondary controls, this is where you will find all the bendy controls sign for the elbow as well. And this is where you'll also find a second set of foot pivot controls. On the IK foot, we do have them as um, channel box values that you can scroll through, but we do have these secondary controls that you can select and animate like that. So depending on which one you like, we have both options. Um, do we have any other secondary controls? Let's see. Yep, that covers it for the secondary controls. Um, we do also have tweak controls, and those are used for very fine detailed sculpting. Um, so on Beta, if you've seen our other character, you could use this a lot for like muscle jiggle run out because like he's a very like muscular, beefy character. For Alpha, since she's a lot more um, lean and slender, you probably wouldn't be using it for that. But probably more if you just have a very slight silhouette or slight curvature change that you'd want. Um, for them. But it does give you a lot of freedom over the shape of her outline. So for the face rig, um, we have a full face rig for Alpha, and we also have a full rig for her hair, both the ponytail and her bangs in the front. For the ponytail in the back, we have a full FK chain. And we also have IK controls as well. For the IK controls, you'll have to turn on secondary control visibility to get those IK controls. And for those, you can use it like an IK um, chain for animating your hair. But we also have the FK 
if you prefer to animate that way. For the fringe at the front, again, same setup. We have an FK and IK setup controls for the fringe. You can do that if you want. We do also have a control on her earrings, so you can animate those as well, which is pretty cool. But yeah, overall, that is a brief overview of the Alpha Rig. Um, in the package that is on the site, there are also a few tools included. Those details are covered in separate videos, so if you're looking for that, make sure to check out the other videos included in the release of this package. And yeah, um, we really hope that you have a fun time animating with Alpha. Of course, if you animate her, please share with us, email it to us, tag us on socials. We'd love to see what you make with this cool character, and we can't wait to see you bring her to life. So yeah, have fun and happy animating. Bye-bye!